In this video, I'm going to show you how to download FTB Stoneblock 4 Mod Pack. The first thing you want to do is you want to open up any web browser like you normally would. Then go to the search bar and type in CurseForge app download just like so. And CurseForge is basically a free platform where we're able to download mod packs and mods incredibly easy. And that's what we're going to be using in order to download the FTB Stoneblock mod. But anyways, go to the official CurseForge.com website right over here. Then you want to go ahead and press on download standalone just like so. Go ahead and click on it and now just wait for it to be installed. Now you want to go ahead and click on the .exe file just like so and then it is going to open up a screen that does look like this. It is going to say welcome to CurseForge so go ahead and press on next then go ahead and press on I accept then go ahead and press on next one more time. And while that's installing let me tell you guys about Simple Game Hosting. Simple Game Hosting allows you to create a 24-7 unlimited salt server for you and your friends. What's great about Simple Game Hosting is that they actually specialize in creating modded servers. So you can play the FTB Stoneblock mod pack with you and all of your friends you guys can also play other mod packs like Pixelmon, Cobblemon, etc. You're able to install mods and mod packs with the click of a single button. You can also make your server Java only, Bedrock only, crossplay. And if you never made a Minecraft server before, do not worry because they have dozens of video tutorials and 24-7 live customer support. At the moment, they're currently doing a sale where everybody who gets a Minecraft server gets 25% off their very first month of server hosting. So if that sounds interesting, feel free to check out the link in the description down below and in the pinned comment. All right, guys, once you went ahead and loaded into CurseForge, please make sure to select on Minecraft. And then afterwards, you're going to get something that looks like this. As you're able to tell, I already did install a bunch of mod packs in the past. All right, so all you want to do is you want to go to the top menu and press on Browse just like so. Then go to the search bar and type in FTB and then Stoneblock right over here. And then just wait for it to load in and you should be able to go ahead and install it from here. So all you want to do is you want to go ahead and click on it and then you want to press on this orange button. Now, if you never downloaded this mod pack before, it is going to say install. So make sure to go ahead and press on that and now and then it's going to begin installing all of the different mods and stuff like that. So just be patient with it. It may take a little while because this is actually a pretty big mod pack. So if it takes a couple minutes, that is perfectly OK and that is perfectly normal. So all you need to do from here is wait for it to be installed. Anyways, guys, once it's finished installing, it is then going to say play. And all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on that button. And now it is going to go ahead and launch Minecraft. All right, guys, so here you are Minecraft. Make sure that FTB stone block is selected right over here. Then go ahead and press on play just like so. All right, guys, and eventually it should load in and you should have something that looks like this. From here, you guys are able to go ahead and begin creating your world. All right, guys, so we just loaded into a world. And then from here, you can go ahead and begin having a ton of fun. If you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial.